The University of British Columbia has declared a climate emergency. The climate crisis is one of the most pressing issues of our time, and UBC wants to ensure that our community and the public is fully informed of the actions the university is taking as a leader in sustainability and climate action. UBC acknowledges the urgency of the climate crisis and will directly face its challenges. At this pivotal moment, the decisions and actions we take today will reverberate beyond our own borders and lifetimes. The UBC Board of Governors has unanimously passed a resolution supporting full divestment of fossil fuels from UBC's Trek Endowment Fund in a manner that is consistent with the fiduciary obligations of the board. The board also unanimously passed a motion approving in principle the full divestment of the remaining balance of the $1.71 billion main endowment fund from the fossil fuel industry. Let me make this clear. UBC is committed to full divestment as soon as possible and we are taking the necessary steps to realize this now. UBC's climate emergency declaration and the board's decision to divest from fossil fuels are just two examples of our commitment to climate action. The university shares and understands the community's concerns regarding the climate crisis and that the continued operation of the fossil fuel industry is discordant with the climate safe future and that indigenous and marginalized communities bear the harmful impacts of fossil fuel extraction and climate destruction while being least responsible for the global acceleration of the climate crisis. That's why we will continue to take steps to ensure that we remain on track to achieve net zero by 2050 in accordance with the Paris Climate Agreement. We have recently committed to advancing several initiatives to champion climate action and effect meaningful change, including the Board's Climate Action Committee and the Climate Emergency Community Engagement Process. It's also why we are encouraging actively other universities to move toward divestment and sustainable investment frameworks in order to combat climate change and create a more sustainable future. We will continue to update our community on this important priority as work proceeds.